My name is Amy Cross, and if you're new here, this is The Cross Legacy, where I teach families all over the world how to save money on groceries and how to eat with special diets because we're actually a diabetic family and have allergies. But right now, we're dealing with a special circumstance, and our grandma, who is 95, lives here with us. Over the last year, she's lost 90 pounds, and she doesn't want to eat a lot, but she will always say yes to ice cream. We're gonna have a little chat with grandma in it also, but I just wanted to be able to say that this was a little bit different of an ice cream type of video for you. This was one to really talk about how having an ice cream machine is improving grandma's quality of life. Now that she's able to eat high protein, low sugar ice cream as much as she wants three times a day, that's not affecting her diabetes. It is adding protein and calories to her diet, which is so important. She is not losing any more weight and she is so frail. It's really important that we keep weight on her. So anyways, if you are dealing with any kind of elderly family members or loved ones and you are trying to look for ideas to get them to eat. The cold sensitivity of being able to eat something that is cold is something that they remember the longest and the sweet taste buds are kind of those last ones to go. So when they want to eat ice cream and you want to be able to give it to them, just make them some higher quality ones. So this one I'm using the best protein powder I can possibly get that goes into the ice cream and then we use um, well, this one's 2%. Normally we use whole milk when we're making grandma's ice cream. We get milk delivery here at our house and it comes tomorrow. <laughs> and then um, you add sugar-free pudding to the ice cream and then that will also help make it smoother. Um, and then I try to get the best ingredient kind of pudding that I can for that. I also will add in things like fiber-wise brownies into it, which just helps a little bit more with um, what she needs in her diet. Um, I can add berries and different things that she will top it with. And we can do fun things like having cappuccino, Heath kind of ice cream in the morning, but she will eat ice cream three times a day. And this is so important. I just want you to encourage you if you are having a loved one that is losing weight and you're trying to get calories in them, that ice cream can be a really great thing. This color green makes your eyes look really green. Green instead of brown. Yeah, yeah, it really brings out the green in them. One of grandma's favorite things ever is ice cream. And we have been worried about her losing so much weight because she has lost a lot of weight this year. And so we were very excited to be able to get her a Ninja Creamy ice cream maker. And so I can make her diabetic friendly, low sugar, high protein ice cream that she can literally eat for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. So. We're gonna talk about some of the favorite ones that you've had so far. The ice cream? Yeah. <clears throat> the chocolate yep. chip cookie and the chocolate. <laughs> you can't be chocolate anymore. <laughs> and uh, I like them all. <laughs> there isn't any ice cream I won't eat. Her portions like for food too are so small, but then she'll eat like three scoops of big ice cream too. So we always like make sure that she eats dinner and then she still gets her ice cream. We got the ice cream maker for her 95th birthday that she just had, which is very special. And we're gonna find out why you don't have ice cream for dessert after breakfast. You can have ice cream for dessert after breakfast. <laughs> That'd be a first, wouldn't it? We yeah. had coffee ice cream the other day. That was delicious. Yeah. The machine maker's on my wanted list. That's why we got it for your birthday, so we can make you all the ice cream you want. Yeah, but I think that one has a cross name on the bottom or something. You've inscribed so I can't get it out here. We'll make it for you whenever yeah. you want it. Okay. <laughs> it's a promise. What kind of ice cream do you want to try next? Just plain chocolate. I did that one right at the very beginning and haven't yes. done it since. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that one again, which is a kind of a fun one because she drinks protein drinks three times a day to help make sure that she has enough calories. So I am just able to make the ice cream straight out of the protein drinks that she normally drinks. So then she's getting the ice cream that she wants and eating more calories, which is a great thing <laughs> when you're 95 years old. Thank you for watching this video today. Make Thank sure you. you check out our link for the Ninja Creamy and we'll have a recipe in the description. Bye. <laughs> okay, if you enjoyed having grandma on video with me, I loved it. If we can do more videos and she is up for it, 
what would you like to see? Would you like to hear more of her stories or things that she enjoys? Being 95 and her living with us is just so special and we are trying to capture all of her memories and stories. So you will be seeing her a lot more on my stories on Instagram. Make sure you check that out.